Hello, uh, what I have here, it's been a while since I've done any videos, uh, but what I have here is a, uh, a Tom Galbraith uh, Stringed Instruments um, F-Style Mandolin. Uh, this is the second carved top mandolin that he's ever built. And uh, uh, I went out there today and uh, and picked it up from him. Just thought I'd do a video to kind of showcase uh, uh, the work that uh, that Tom does. And he, he does great work and uh, builds some fine sound of mandolins. And uh, you got the TG inlay on the front here. And uh, ebony fingerboard. With, uh, he, he put banjo frets on it. He was telling me, and uh, Engelman spruce top, ebony bridge, nice curly maple back and sides, flame maple, nice curl on the neck, shallow tuners. Sorry, my tone guard's in the way a little bit there. Black binding. And uh, he also has some, uh, some F-style uh, flat tops available for sale. And uh, also has a couple A-model flat tops, F-holes and O-holes. So if you're interested in those, you can you can look him up on Facebook at uh, uh, Galber Stringed Instruments. And uh, here's how uh, how she sounds. a little uh, 
couple different tunes and some uh, improv picking there on it. But a uh, heck of heck of a man, heck of a mandolin, and uh, got a nice woof to it, and uh, good craftsmanship. It's got good tuners on it. Nice, nice uh, Engelman spruce top. Flame curly maple back and sides. And uh, just got it today. So still getting used to it, you know, how it's set up. And the, uh, uh, it's got like a, a nice V neck on it here. Pretty chunky, almost uh, actually pretty similar to the Collins MT that I had. Uh, as far as the the way that the neck feels, a little bit chunkier, but the V is almost almost identical. 